Behold, Titan Slayer. The Pillars of Hercules, nothing further beyond. Pass these gates and know the unknown. Surely danger lurks in these undiscovered places. But the rewards may prove to be enlightening. Who knows what secrets will be found in this dark realm. What tide has carried you here? Do you wish to become a god? To glimpse worlds beyond worlds? Each one of us is here for a reason. But you don't belong here. The gods know why you're here, Keeper. But some gates should never be opened. I know what you've done. And I'd say you owe me. The underworld is filled with kings, heroes, legends, all lost. You could give them that purpose.
We return to you now. As the gods of mankind. Rulers of the Greeks and the Norse. The Egyptians and the Atlanteans. We created mankind to fight for our glory. So rise and wield my wrath. Command beastly chaos. Rain down destruction. And unleash our fury. Worship me. Claim my power. And legend will be yours. Critias Empire pits you, the ruler of Atlantis, against the ancient gods in a story of overcoming adversity worthy of a Greek epic. But how does this work in practice? And how can you play against the seemingly random whims of the gods? Firstly, your mystics and soothsayers will warn you ahead of time that disaster is coming, and importantly, how long you have before disaster strikes. These prophecies also give a hint as to how the disaster will play out. Typically, a favourable disaster might result in new land rising out of the sea, providing fresh opportunities to harvest resources and settle new areas. Whereas, a more destructive disaster could lead to the ground beneath your feet changing shape or even completely disappearing below the waves. However, you can also call upon the gods to rescue your sunken cities and reposition your farms that may have been lifted to the tops of mountains. This is done by spending prayers the goodwill you have accumulated with the gods from building temples and looking after your pious citizens. You can also build shrines. These protect the lands around them from changing during a disaster. Or you can ask the oracle to predict the outcome of an impending disaster. If all your citizens starve or are washed away by the sea, your empire will vanish into dust and you will lose the game. And to win, you must build wonders of the world to impress the gods Enough to stop trying to destroy you, at least.